to my channel. Today I'm going to go over all of the linked character details about Disney's next animated musical, Encanto. Full credit to the Dis Insider for this scoop, they are a great news source so you should definitely check them out. My theory is that these names and descriptions were given for the purposes of auditions. I think that the descriptions are real but the names are false. First up we have our leading character, Mirabelle Magdigal. This brief says her name is Mariana but we know from the official Disney press release that her name is actually Mirabelle. Pending negotiation, she will be played by Stephanie Beatrice from Brooklyn Nine-Nine. She is a 15-year-old girl who is a lovable, funny, fallible, utterly human protagonist. She uses her humour to cover up struggles with her self-worth. She is a true comedian akin to Lucille Ball. Additionally, she will be the narrator of the film. I really like the idea of having a funny female character as usually funny characters don't get to be the lead. I think she is going to be very similar to Anna from Frozen who I love. However, Encanto is not going to be a one man show, with Lin-Manuel Miranda stating in an interview that it will be an intergenerational family story with all the complexity that brings. There are two characters on this list that I presume are Mirabelle's older sisters, Inez and Lydia. Inez is a supporting character in her early 20s. She is the golden child of the family with a beautiful singing voice. On the outside, she seems to have everything together yet is deeply insecure. I already think that this is going to be my favourite character. I really enjoy characters who act confident but are deeply insecure. It's part of the reason why I love Cass from Tangled the series so much. The second sister is Lydia who is a supporting character in her early 20s. She is an athletic jock with a big voice and personality. She is funny yet sincere and has a small amount of singing. Lydia's part seems smaller than the other two sisters and I really hope they cast a really strong actress as she doesn't sing a lot. The character presumed to be the mother of the family is Juna. She is a supporting character in her mid 40s. She is a maternal presence in the film, a deep thinker and a good listener. Honestly it's a miracle we have an alive mother in this film. The character I think is Mirabelle's father is Fernando. He is a supporting character in his late 40s. He is handsome, funny and loud. He is the life of the party, loyal and kind with an excellent singing voice. Honestly I don't have a lot of strong feelings about this character. He seems a little cookie cutter so I really hope there's more to him. The last member of the family is Andrea who is the matriarch aka the grandmother of the family. At 75 years old she is strong and determined sometimes to a fault. With a dry wit and tough presence she doesn't let anyone get in her way. Honestly she sounds really similar to Miguel's grandmother in Coco. The final character on this list is Carlos who is not a member of the family. Carlos is a 15 year old boy who is Mirabelle's enemy. Like Mirabelle he is hilariously funny and also a great singer. Has a habit of telling tall tales though. He is quite obviously Mirabelle's love interest, the classic enemies to lovers trope. I'm calling it now. In addition to this amazing information shared by the Dis Insider, the Illuminati also shared information about two additional characters. Now these may be the same characters with different names, I'm not 100% sure. The first character is Dolores who is a 20 year old Afro Latina woman. She's socially awkward and anxious but is well intentioned and honest. Dolores must be a good singer. The second character is Camillo, a 16 year old Afro Latina boy. He's a natural performer and storyteller. Camillo is an entire highly comfortable being himself and is able to do impressive impressions of others. Camillo must be a good singer. Anyway that's all the Encanto information that I have for you today. Please like this video if you liked it and please subscribe, it would mean so much to me. Bye now and have a magical day!